Hey, what's going on everybody? It's IMXYZ and today I am making a different type of video that is a video for all of my men out there when it comes to their man downstairs. This is a video about the pee shot. Now, I just got my second pee shot done and I wanted to talk to you guys about it because there's a lot of men out there that are looking into this procedure and one of the biggest things about it is, you know, it's, it's non-invasive, it's 25 minutes, you go in, they numb your penis, they inject you with stem cells that comes from your own body and you walk out the door and that's it, right? But I wanted to talk to people about it because there's, a, there's not a lot of videos on it on the internet from real people, like real people like me or and you. It's always like a doctor talking or something like that. It's, it's not someone that's just, hey, I got it and this is what, what, what took place. Now I went to a place in Roswell, Georgia called Park Ave Cosmetic Center and I got the procedure done. And I wanted to kind of talk to you guys about it and kind of give you guys some pointers, heads up, uh, what to look out for, what not to look for, or what to expect. So the first thing is, the reason why I got it is more of a preventative maintenance. I don't have a problem uh, ejaculating or getting a hard on or anything like that, but I will say this. One of the big benefits of getting the pee shot is that my erections are harder, kind of like how it was when I was in high school. Now, anybody that that's you know in their 30s and above knows that, yeah, you get hard, you're just not as hard as you used to be and it's just not as frequent as it used to be. Like I used to wake up with hard-ons in the morning and throughout the day I'd have some, even when I was in school, I used to have to tuck it in between my belt buckle. Uh, as you get older, it just becomes less. You're still up, it's just not as frequent. It's kind of like if you lifted weights. In high school, you could bench press or do a lot of push-ups and you can't do as many now. Not to say that you're weak, you just can't do as many now. So the P shop really helps with that and it's a big reason why uh, I continue to get it every about every four months. Uh, they say it lasts between a year and eight and eighteen months, but I like to just you know keep everything strong down there. It's kind of like a I don't even want to say a natural Viagra, but kind of like a natural Viagra. Um, your erections are harder. Uh, they happen more frequent, and the recovery times faster. And you do gain size. So for me, I'm an average size guy in uh, from head to toe, average size penis, average size hands, shoes, everything is just average. I'm just an average guy. Um, but with that being said, when you get the pee shot, a positive side effect of it is that your penis length and girth does grow. It doesn't grow two inches where all of a sudden you're like a, a porn star or anything like that, but you can grow 0.25 inches, a quarter inch, a half inch. Um, they, there's been some um, studies online, which it's very hard to find, but there have been some studies where a, a guy's grown an inch and a half, but that didn't happen to me. I grew about five inches in length, right? Um, which for an average guy is a lot, right? I'm not king dingaling swinging from a tree, but my wife is happy. Happy wife, happy life. Make a come every day, keep the stress away. <laughs> That's life advice. Um, but the, the big thing about it is, it just keeps you strong and you're just really doing the preventative maintenance to, to continue to keep your sex life up and to continue to perform really well. What people get wrong a lot of times, whether it's skincare regimen or anything like that is, they do not do the preventative maintenance, they do it when it's too late. And when it's too late and the, and the, and the ship already has a crack in the boat, by the time you patch that crack, there's more cracks that have happened and now your boat sinks. It's the same thing with the body. You got to eat well, you got to exercise, you got to drink a lot of water, you got to keep your mind mentally clear and positive and stay away from stressful things and images and sounds and just continue to live your best life and be the best you. So that's why I get the pee shot and that's why I continuously get it and I just got my second shot and I'm so happy about it because I know that not only was I able to perform just fine prior to, but now I'm able to perform better. We spend all this money on our cars and rims and clothes and phones and, and computers and TVs and clothes, but you gotta always take care of the, the flesh machine first and then do the other thing. So this is just part of that routine of, of working out every day, drinking a lot of water, doing my smoothies, um, and then doing the pee shot. Now, uh, I've read some of the forums um, and, and have read some of the questions, and I'm just gonna answer some of the questions that I've read in comments, not in this video, but in other uh, websites to help people uh, possibly in their decision making. Now, it's not cheap, it's about twelve to $1,500, but what I would say is save up for it. If you can do it once a year, it's supposed to last between 12 and 18 months. So if you can do it once a year, just save up 100 bucks a month and to get it done. Now, this isn't for someone that's 18 years old. 
excuse me, or 25. This is for the men that are like in their late 20s, 30s and older, right? Uh, and it benefits the men the most that their testosterone levels are good and they take care of themselves. Those are prime candidates to get the P shot. Also, if you have a bigger penis, typically you get more gains as far as length and girth. Uh, I don't know why that is, but you tend to get more gains. They say that you wanna at least be five inches to get the best results. So anyone that's below five inches, I say still get it because you never know. You may be that that 60%, 80% that, that has fine results, right? And when you're at that point, you have nothing to lose because a harder erection and just being better down there, every man knows that that is like their prime tool. That's your hammer, that's your prime jewel. Being better down there just makes you better overall, right? Now, of course, your heart, your head, your spirit, all that good stuff. Yeah, we're not talking about that right now. We're talking about as a man and how we view ourselves. So having that tool perform better I mean, what can you say? Kobe Bryant, Tiger Woods, they all got stem cell injections in their knees and their shoulders. This is the same thing, it's just going into your penis. Um, another question I read was, uh, there was a couple old men thinking about getting it. Absolutely, If and I would say this, drink a lot of water that week, two weeks leading up to knowing, hey, I'm gonna get my pee shot in a couple weeks, let me go and hydrate my whole body. So when they draw blood from you, because that's where the stem cells come from, when they draw blood from you, your blood is good and, and you're getting the best stem cells out of it. But if you're an older gentleman, married, single, it doesn't matter, and you're having some, you take Cialis or Viagra and you're having some uh, issues, or maybe not even issues, you're just not performing as, as as well as you could absolutely get it because what do you have to lose some money let's say it doesn't work out for you and your and your benefit is five percent that's five percent better than it was before and what do you lose out on money money comes and goes you you gain it you lose it you transfer it over it goes back and it comes back so what I recommend everybody try it um, I also recommend anyone try it anyone to do it more than once. I've read, and I'll tell you guys uh, after this video, uh, six uh, weeks from now, what the results are of doing it twice. I've read that a lot of times you get results the first time, which I absolutely got. I got a half an inch the first time, what can I say? Uh, I'm a happy man, right? But you, you get results the first time, but then you get better results the second time. So I'm going to test that theory. Another question is, does it hurt? No, it doesn't. It's a walk-in, walk-out procedure. Yeah, you, you, they draw your blood, they numb your penis for 20 minutes, they inject you five times, and then you're done. You walk right out, um, and that's all it is. There's no, it, they don't, it doesn't hurt. There's a, there's a little sting from the needle, but it doesn't hurt, uh, and you wanna make sure you take that entire 20 minutes to numb your penis. Um, another thing I read was, does it cure uh, curves in the penis? I've seen some things where they said, yes, my penis is straight, so there's no curve, so I don't know, but I've read that it does, because what, what it's doing is it's, it's building new fibers and tissues in that 